but sometimes you'll also find in, in the federal system uh, an occasional bankruptcy fraud case that's that's brought and it's and it's always a person who is filing bankruptcy who fails to include uh, disclose assets uh, things like that they're trying to hide assets or the allegation could be they're overstating what their their um, situation is as far as liabilities go in other words trying to defraud the bankruptcy court in in some manner whether it's trying to get a, a discharge of debt or by the fact that they have uh, fewer assets than they really do or that they have more liabilities you'll often find a situation where you'll have someone who's alleged to have committed bankruptcy fraud to have just simply or purposely left out a, a number of assets who are just trying to hide assets and use bankruptcy as a um, as a screen or as a as a hiding mechanism to um, either just maintain debt, maintain assets, or to get out of debts that are hanging over their head.